What's up Airsoft fam, Dark Tree here, back with another video, and this is going to be part 2 of BB Wars Coastal Front. Go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button and share this video with a fellow airsofter, and go ahead and hit me down in the comments if you're going to be at BB Wars Air Revival, or if you attend the Coastal Front, go ahead and comment and let me know how you enjoyed your BB Wars. And with that being said, let's just jump back into this video. Like I said, it's going to be part 2 of BB Wars Coastal front and I hope you guys enjoy and let's just jump into this video so after a three hour drive it was time to get some R&R &R. myself and Ackwright were dumb tired from the drive and uh, we were checking into our hotel rooms up in Redding California and uh, I was just doing some uh, gear check here just making sure all my electronics were working my run cam uh, scope cam, my GoPros. I just wanted to make sure everything was up to snuff. Um, of course, batteries are always a big part of airsoft, whether you're running them um, in your guns or running them um, in your uh, recording equipment, etc. It's always a good idea to make sure that your electronics, your audio, especially your batteries, are working properly because you don't want to record a whole day of gameplay and get back home and find out that all your audio is no good. So I was just making sure here all my audio was looking good and uh, yeah, I wanted to make sure everything was ready to go. And now it's time for me to do a gear check. Um, I got this bag for BB Wars and here I'm just going through my gear, making sure everything is ready. Those are my Gore-Tex shoes uh, from Nike. And um, just making sure my HPA setup, my plate carrier was uh, good to go for tomorrow. Uh, here we have my Kythera build and my MGC4 Mark II. Actually, that's the Mark I. And uh, I didn't know exactly what pistol I wanted to run. I did end up running the AP-01, um, but I did bring a couple of Glocks and my TM uh, 4.3 High Kappa. I did bring my uh, 45 as a backup, but I didn't know whether to bring the 17, but I did go with the 45 in the end. Of course, this is airsoft fuel right here. If you're not sipping on your mate for your energy drinks, ladies and gentlemen, I don't know what you're doing. Yeah, I even had time for a little shave. Uh, I was looking hella ashy up top, but I got real close to the grain because uh, we we're going to be doing a lot of sweating tomorrow. And as you can see, I'm running Empire. Yeah, so after making sure my gear was ready, um, all the uniform, everything was, you know, ready, I was heading to bed, and tomorrow morning, ta-da, we're at BB Wars. Uh, myself and Akrite were just getting ourselves ready to go. He was just doing a final gear check. We're just getting our stuff ready to head to the field. And on our way up, Guess who we run into? Our guys down at Airsoft GI, Isaiah, Justin, and Boaz. You can see him here in the background. 
Justin is one of the guys in the, in the storefront. He's not in a lot of videos, a lot of shorts, but uh, he's definitely in the storefront all day helping you guys out. Big part of Airsoft GI team. And uh, we were checking in right here, and uh, guess who shows up? The Mayo Man himself, Cisco. And uh, he was there to greet your boy Dartree and Arkwright, and uh, it was all hugs. And he was letting us know that Fidel had showed up. He wasn't supposed to be coming. I think he had some issues getting down here to California, but he was letting us know right here that Fidel was going to join us. High fidelity, so... We were overjoyed to have them here. And uh, Cisco's letting you guys know to like and subscribe. And yeah, walking into BB Wars, first thing that happened was a drip check, check you know, by Oh Isaiah. man, we doing it right it here for anybody? Ooh, yeah. Drip check, drip check, yeah. Yeah. UF Pro, everything. We got the Nike, uh, Gore-Tex. Uh, Samsung watch. You oh, know, the, the, it, it's dripper. <laughs> Uh, Multicam black on the Slickster, oh, you know, yes, the S-Tac. Oh, yes, sir. You know, uh, Core Essentials belt, uh, T-Rex arms little pistol right there. Damn, yeah, bro. dude, I uh, went all out for you guys. Ooh. This right here is a horizontal mag holder right there. Ooh. That quick draw, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Ooh. Yeah. Oh, man, looking mighty clean. Bro. You like to go ahead and touch that. You know that? You know, Empire for Life, baby. Yeah. Oh, you guys are part of the enemy. Oh, you know what? You gotta have somebody shoot at them. You gotta have somebody. Yeah, yeah, all right. to drip check all the homies came out we got airsaw brewer he showed up had a great time playing with a homie that uh i never got to meet in person but this is the first time we actually got to meet at bb wars and uh we always miss each other at the storefront but it was about time <laughs> right here we got my boy chef panakage he showed up Act right, getting ready for a round of B right, Wars. Has. And we got Fidel, came all the way out from yeah, Hawaii. Yeah. Shots out but to Fidel. High Fidelity yeah, coming so out. Empire, and uh, but we Fidel had a great time made it in. playing on the had Empire. all surprised, but he is here, and we're all complete now. <laughs> oh, yeah. our special event, BB Wars, brought to you by Airsoft GI, US Airsoft. That's the tactical family force. It's gonna be a great day having fun and games and we're gonna go and show you a good time. This is a great singer. He is. Yeah. Hey, thank you guys so much for coming out. Honestly you guys, like, you know, we wanted to come to bring BB Wars back to California for the longest time. And uh, honestly, like we we've been looking around and this place is like probably one of the nicest airsoft facilities we've ever been to. Are you ready to play? Yeah! Oh, yeah. Are you ready to play? Cisco's on the podium right now. Here are the troops. You ready to act right? Oh, come on. Beautiful, thank you. Yeah, there's one right here. Lord Cisco. 
Yeah. That's a slick rig, my buddy. <laughs> we have intel. Keep your hands down. We do have a flag right in front of the bridge. We can keep the fence line. We can, we can keep going down that way. Keep their heads down. As long as we get the flag down and keep them away from it, we will hold that. Okay. Okay? If we can get guys in there, a good squad, better. Okay. Hey, guys. We got to try to make a run for the flag. Okay. Apparently, we have intel where it is. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> I'll do <laughs> Where's that right? Wait. Oh, 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 there he is. <laughs> That's it, man. And Isaiah. What's up, guys? The Empire just uh, wiped the floor with the rebels. Oh, we got Chef right behind me. And can you say your name exactly? Trinity. Trinity, yes, <laughs> Trinity. I want to say the whole thing, but I'm like, I get all lost when I say the last part. <laughs> I'm lost. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Worst case scenario, you just go to forbid. Yeah. What up, RGK? Bro, what's going on, yo? How you on? Man, you came out early to eat? Look at you. No, I didn't. I, I literally came out when the, the whole thing was I didn't see you out there. I was out there. I was in here the entire time. I think you I, went to go I, get the food. I, I you went to go get the food, didn't you? <laughs> Dude. I seen you Did you see me all prone? Just <laughs> that pretty gun. Just like, pop, pop. I was like, anybody taking pictures? <laughs> I had a great time. Great time. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> Not prepared. <laughs> Not prepared at all. <laughs> Not again. So what's up? I got knifed again. Archie, Kev, Kev, come here. Come here. Come here. Hey, come here. <laughs> That's the face of a man that got stabbed. <laughs> <laughs> Double stab? Double stabbed up? 50 push ups. Oh, yeah, I did get knocked by somebody. <laughs> okay, look, some, some dude, like, he got right in the corner. It was dark. <laughs> it was so dark. It takes a couple years, but he did it like a year. He's got a building out there named after him now. Oh, really? Oh, hey. 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 When you become a general here, we name a building after him. Oh, that's, that's what's up. up. He said, Rebels, come in. I found these knuckle sandwiches. Mayo gang? That's what's up. Woo! From Hawaii. Senti Dicks! <laughs> you are I had to. I had to, bro. Oh, Brewer! Brewer! <laughs> so, another member of the power. He's actually going to be giving his prize. Oh. Woo! So after BB Wars, we were all dumb tired and famished and it was time to get some grub and we hit up a Korean barbecue spot that was somewhat sus but when you're as hungry as we were after BB Wars, it don't matter. We wanted to eat and uh, shouts out to the boss man himself. He uh, took us out to a nice dinner after a long day of slinging some plastic at your boys and uh yeah we had a great time Cisco was all up in my camera <laughs> it was the best time though honestly guys uh shout out to boaz shout out to isaiah and uh everyone that showed up uh chef um This is us uh, going into uh, that Korean barbecue place and uh, we're trying to figure out where we're gonna be seated. And uh, once we got that all figured out, you know, it was time to get down for some grub, man. I mean, we were all 
all dumb hungry. Cisco always looking out for your boy, making sure that he is sharing that social media wealth. <laughs> Shots off to Real Wild, you can see him right there. I didn't get a lot of footage, but you can see uh, RGK was there, Real Wild. Uh, his son showed up and uh, showed out and had a great time at BB Wars. Uh, this is uh, us doing a little toast and um, yeah. Yeah, the food wasn't uh, super legit, <laughs> but like I said, when you're that hungry, it really don't matter. And when it's free, it tastes twice as good. So the meal was pretty fantastic. Yeah, after a long night, long day, it was time to say our goodbyes to all the homies from BB Wars. Uh, we were just, uh, you know, shaking hands and, uh, you know, making sure that everyone got home safe, everyone had a ride, and, you know, just, it was all hugs, and we were just, you know, just happy that everyone that did show out had a great time, and uh, we just were enjoying ourselves, and yeah, it was, it's fantastic. Uh, this trip, in my opinion, is uh, one of the best airsoft experiences I've ever had, and um, it's gonna be a hard one to beat, for sure. Next day, uh, it was time to pack up and take off. Uh, I was just throwing some stuff in my car here, and uh, you know, I just wanted to make sure I had everything packed up. Ackright, like I said before, was a great host. Um, he was just giving me some water here to make sure I was ready for my journey. And uh, shouts out again to Ackright, appreciate you, bro. Thanks for uh, showing your homie around and we had a great time. All right, thanks you guys for watching. That was a wrap up of BB Wars Coastal Front. I enjoyed myself greatly. Uh, anybody that came up to me and talked to me, uh, thank you guys for being so friendly. I really enjoyed the field, the crowd, the people, and the airsoft was top notch. So thank you guys, and I really enjoyed myself. Uh, special shout out to Ackright. Um, great dude, awesome uh, hospitality, and uh, I made a friend through BB Wars. So so that was awesome. So shouts out to Ackright, shouts out to everyone down at Airsoft GI and all the homies, the Mayo gang, the mod squad, we met up and we had an awesome time as you guys saw. Um, and uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and please share this video with a fellow Airsofter. Your like and subs go a long way to channel growth and I greatly appreciate it. And with that being said, remember to aim down sight. See you guys next time.